Hi there guys, welcome back to Britannia Garden of Glass. How is everyone doing? I hope you're well. Um, yeah, so today, today, uh, we have to firstly fix something quick. Uh, someone brought it to my attention that... Um, the safety feature I added to the TNT thing might not actually work properly, so let's go fix that. Uh, so I've updated Britannia again. Uh, the flying thing now has 30 seconds instead of 10 seconds, which is super cool. Um, because, yeah, I, I 10 seconds was a bit not a lot, really. Uh, so, let's just head down here. So, uh, we need to just change this slightly. Uh, I'm going to make this slightly bigger. Um, I'm going to have to move that as well. Is this... This is fortune. Oh, I don't have a... Yeah. Yeah, actually, this should be fine. We'll just do it a different way. Okay, so we'll do this, this, this. And we will put this here. This here, this here. So this, when it goes red, we, oh, sorry. When it goes red, um, like when it, when it turns on, this should lock this one. So we're gonna move the um, timer to here. And boom. Cool, so this should still trigger this. We'll just wait for this redstone to trigger. Bing, and, but if we put a redstone torch here, you can see that this won't trigger. And that way, the the um, the redstone hitting that in some circumstances might have caused it to blow up. So this is this I think it should be one, two, three, four, five, six. It should get about through just over two thirds full, I think. Cool. Uh, so that's just a quick fix that I wanted to do there on camera, just to show you guys in case you were making a similar sort of thing. Uh, thanks to whoever it was who posted in the comments. Sorry, I don't have it up at the moment. Uh, I don't know. I can't find it. Sorry. So, today. Today I want to have a look at... Um, my frame rate is hella slow, so I'm just going to change this to decrease and hopefully that will increase. Yep. Uh, no. Slightly better. Mm. Uh, so today we're going to look at a new flower. Uh, this was added a couple of weeks, uh, I think it was almost a month ago now. A couple of releases ago anyway. Uh, and it was added because the passive flowers were nerfed. As we all know, because I tried to use some passive flowers at the beginning and they just disappeared. So, there's this new flower called the Raffle Raffalos, uh, whatever. Uh, which eats these passive flowers to produce mana, which is pretty cool in my opinion. Um, so uh, we're gonna make this thing, which needs a rune of pride, summer and fire, earth and air. Okay, so this is gonna take a bit of crafting. I think I'll probably do the crafting off camera. I mean, besides from that, the the flowers are simple enough. Um, now the generating flares, we want to get a good few of each of these. Which don't require any sort of runes or anything like that. So yeah, cool. That should be easy enough. Yeah, so these are all very easy to make. And I don't think they repeat colors, do they? Uh, Daybloom. 
and they do repeat colors. So we're gonna have to also need to make sure we have a lot of flowers. Um, we might need to sort these somehow. That might be something we have to do in the next couple of episodes as well, because we want to start getting this thing properly automated. Uh, we need to automate this as well. So they're the two things that we're going to automate in the next couple of episodes. But first I want to just get this thing going because I think it's cool. Okay, let me... Um okay, I'm going to craft this and we'll be back in a minute. Okay, guys. Um, I have myself one of these flowery things. Uh, let's, let's try this thing out. Um, let's get ourselves a mana pool and a spreader. And a spreader. Oh, actually, the recipe for sparks was meant to be made easier. So, four less blaze powder. Okay, that's not really easier. Ahem. Do, do, do. What am I looking for? Spreader. That's just a flower and wood, isn't it? Let's make a, a, a thingy one. Oh, these are planks, aren't they? No, we don't want that. Yeah, there we go. That will do. It's just this, isn't it? Literally the recipe I forget every single time. There we go. Boom. Uh, let's just head over here to test this thing out. Um, right, so let's try this thing out then. Uh, we put this down. Mana spreader. And then we put a day bloom down and it just eats it. Oh, whoops. There we go. There we go, that should be it. Uh, okay, yeah, no, that's taking the mana. Um, about a quarter of a diluted pool. And then I think the second one gives less. Yeah, a lot less. So we're going to want to rotate between the three different ones then. Uh, three different ones, I wonder, can we get away with just... Uh, we want to diminishing returns. The same type of flower should not be destroyed multiple times in a row. So we might get away with just doing the two, um, the nightshade and the day bloom, because they do not use the same, the same colors. Okay, let's just get a couple of these um, day blooms. Two yellow. Light blue and orange. Two yellow. Light blue and orange. I think I'm going to need some more seeds, actually. Cool. I'll start making these then and the nightshades. And we'll see if we can get something going. Okay, so I have myself 32 nightshade and 32 day blooms. 
Um, we're going to set something up here just quickly to see if we can get something nice going. Uh, we need another torch. And some sand. That should be enough, I think. Uh, let me just sleep quickly. Right, so here what we're gonna do. Here what we're gonna do. We got ourselves a floating ranicarpus. Uh, so when we chuck down one of these, it should place it and then eat us. Um, we probably need to, uh, yeah, let's use some of this stuff. So we'll place it there instead. That should work. Uh, we got some stuff here. Yeah. Right. So what we need to do now is basically we're going to have two droppers. And these droppers are going to just have the two different types in here. Uh, we'll hook up these. And let's just, right, uh, uh, will that work? Uh, I don't have enough space here, actually. Yeah. Uh, let's just take out this fence for now. We just need to take a bit more out. Yeah. That should be fine for now. And just so we don't fall off. Awesome. Okay, let's... Uh, oh, I went over to get more torches, didn't I? Oh, well. Let's do this, this, and this is going to drop one. And let me just get a stick quickly. So we want to do this this and we'll have one pointing into this which should hopefully be that oh we've no redstone oh really so what we're here making here is a uh, just a latch type thing so we'll swap toggle between the two outputs um, so we're just going to put the hourglass here uh, we'll put six in it for now I think six should be enough like a maximum enough but uh, I think it probably get going with less and I'm not sure if this one's gonna trigger let's check it out oh it's not actually finished here Oh, it does. Excellent. Perfect. I think we could probably have less. Oh, no. This should be about right. Looks good. Let's let's take out some sand. I think we can do it less than this. Uh, 
Actually, I think we can go even faster than this. Cool. Yeah, so that's that going, pretty much. Um, it was more of a proof of concept for now. Um, we can pretty much get that going. Once we can automate the production of these things, then definitely uh, we can get going properly with this thing. Oh, this is... Uh, yeah, this is... This can't keep up now. Uh, we might need a potency lens on this or a better spreader. We can make a potency one though quick enough. Yeah, that should do it. It's just about keeping up, so... Cool, yeah, okay. So there's just a quick proof of concept for this new flower, uh, generating flower. Um, doesn't take that much, like a couple of flowers. We can produce a ton of flowers using that thing over there. Uh, so we might get that going. That would be cool. Um, a nice, simple mana production using not a lot of resources. Okay guys, so uh, I'm going to leave it there for today. If you haven't seen it already, um, I've started live streaming um, FTB Infinity uh, Evolved. Um, and yeah, I'm, I don't have a schedule for that yet, but if you follow me on Twitter or if you're on YouTube, you'll see it popping up. And of course, they get archived as well. So uh, join me on those ones. And until next time, I'll see you later.